Hey guys, it's Vicki. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a thread up haul. Now with this haul, I actually pick the items out so I can resell them. Um, I got a lot of these things were final priced, they were low, and um, I'm still waiting on one more box to show up. I think it'll be here Friday. So I'm going to go through this one first. I'll go ahead and say I spent $90 in all, and basically for each piece that I have, I need to at least make back $12.99. Um, to make my money back. So I think I should do pretty good when it comes to making at least $12.99 back. So I'll at least make my money back, but I'm sure that I'll make a, a decent profit off of some of these items. Um, but anyway, so let's go ahead and get into this little haul. So as you see, I got my box. It came in from Pennsylvania today. Um, I did open it, but I did not open anything that was inside. I just made sure which one it was. So I will go ahead and show you the inside. I got the little paper. It's going to tell me. So yeah, everything is still packaged. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go through, show you what I got. Um, I guess I can tell you what these things are. Um, it says I have an estimated to total savings uh, for retail of $576. So currently in this box, there are one, two, three, four, five, six items. And like I said, I'm still waiting on another box. So let's go ahead and get into this. So it looks like everything is just wrapped up completely together. Um, how cute. I love their little tags. Okay, so they put a letter in, which I'm not going to read. Um, but yeah, I'll read that later. Alright, so everything is folded up real nice on the inside. As you can see. Um, cute little labels on everything. Alright, so the first item I have is this gorgeous Akimi and Ken dress. Um, it is a size 4. I was comping things on Poshmark. And this dress... It sells for a pretty decent amount. I did see some sellers that were selling it cheaper. Um, but yeah, this one is just, it's gorgeous. I love it. It's got like the wider, what is it, the kimono sleeve. Um, it's so pretty. So, so pretty. It's a shorter dress. But yeah, um, it's very see-through. So, um, but I just thought it was gorgeous. I really did. So, I'm going to try my hand at the whole reselling um, from online arbitrage, as they say. I don't know. <clears throat> Alright, the next item is a pair of frame denim. And these are small too. These are 24 inch waist. They are the, the La High Flare Coachella and a lot of festivals are coming up soon so I'm trying to kind of stock more boho flare leg type stuff um, in my closet just for that reason because Coachella is in April and April it'll be here very 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 soon so um, so yeah it's just these cute little flares um, it's kind of a dark wash I don't see anything wrong with it some of these things I was like why are they so cheap um, I think I paid, how much did I pay for these? It doesn't say. It just says final sale. So I want to say they're like $12.99 or something like that. So, um, yeah. Cute. Um, the next item. Huh. Okay, so my other stuff. So I mainly have jeans right now. Alright, so these are, what is this? Top Shop? Did I buy Top Shop? Oh, I'm not happy. Okay, these are not what I thought they were. Anyway, so these are Topshop. Um, I'll just show you this label because it's the only one there is. So these are... They are like the cuffed ankle. They're high-waisted pants, I guess. But they don't look high-waisted to me. 
I don't know. That's not high waisted. That's mid rise. Maybe these are the straight. Anyway, so I guess they are mid rise straight jeans, straight leg, whatever. I'll put them in my closet. We'll see. But for those, I paid 12 bucks. That might be too much. All right. These are a pair of Madewell flea market flares. Um, I think these are adorable. So there's the tag. And then it says flea market flare. And for these, I paid $16. So we'll see. Um, but yeah, so these are very flared. And I'm going to say they're high waisted as well. Yep, yep, yep. Very high waisted. They're in good condition. They're just like a medium wash, I guess this is. And the next are is a dark wash, made well. I like made well jeans. These are high waisted. Another pair of flea market flares. Okay. Um. So yeah, just another pair. These ones are dark wash, and. Flary, flary. It's very cute. And then the last item. I don't know. I kind of want my other box to be here. Okay, so these are Mark Fisher. I saw these. They're really cute. And I didn't pay much for these either. I paid 13 bucks for these. So, um, let me fix them. So they actually look like they're supposed to look. Okay, well anyway, I'll go ahead and show you. Look at these. Aren't they different? I think they're so cute. Um, Mark Fisher, these are size 6. Of course I got a bad size, but yeah, really cute. Um, in pretty good shape. But yeah, I love the little tassels. I thought that was too adorable. Um, so... That's that. Um, I'll probably do a haul video on Friday when I get the other box. But I don't remember what all I got now. I know I have a dress. It is a, um, oh gosh, what is the dress that I got? It's really cute. Anyway. All right, so that was it for this little thread up haul. I know it was not a lot. It's not going to be a very long video. Um, but I wanted to try my hand at um, online arbitrage just to see, like, if it's really worth um, you know, buying stuff online to resell. Um, the only reason that I used ThreadUp was not only was I a first time buyer, so you get the 30% off, but also because they have the program Affirm where you can make multiple payments over time. So I can make three payments, so it split up my payments. So I was like, oh, that's interesting. So, um, yeah, that's what I did. So, um, got 30% off. My total was $90. And after I sell everything, I need to make at least $12.99 per item. And that will cover um, what I paid. So, I'm going to aim for more than $12.99, obviously. But, alright, so um, that's it. I have some more hauls that I'm going to do here in a few minutes. I'm going to start recording them. I went to the bins today. I got 23 pounds, which is minor compared to some of you. And I went to Goodwill Retail Store and Salvation Army. So I got some pretty good stuff from one of the retail stores in the Salvation Army. The other retail store, I decided that I was going to shop the Dollar Rack. And I wasn't going to pay any attention to brands. I was just going to pick up stuff that I would wear, that I would buy for myself. Of course, ignoring the size because it's not easy to find clothes in my size. I am like a 1XL, I guess, in shirts most of the time. Um, so you usually find a lot of smaller items, unfortunately, but it is what it is. So yeah, I'm going to probably work on that video next, and I will upload that probably sometime tomorrow. So I hope you all have a great night, and I will talk to you on the next video. Bye.